This is a box. What's in the box? Well, it is fragile. <laughs> Handle with care. Just kidding. But yeah, let's find out what's in the box together right now. Yeah, you know it's bad I got the ducks in here, so... Oh, man, look at these nuts. Garbage. The lovely Atomic logo. Which would be a lot better if this camera fucking focused, but yeah. But what could it be? I mean, of course it is a fan. But it is a fan. Sears. Now this is where it gets kind of interesting. Because it actually is similar to my little Sanyo uh, SP12 whatever i can't remember off the top of my head but yeah i mean i saw this i mean i felt it was unique because it was a sanyo made sears but it's not the green sanyo made sears it's amber and it's got a little bit of a safety cage and according to the data plate i can show it without knocking anything down and it's upside down so uh, it's a model 564422802. Frick AC 120 volts, 60 hertz. See, Sears Canada. Yeah. And this is where things get even weirder. Apparently, the seller made a point that this was circa 1982. Which I'm inclined to believe because amber color, brown, whatever, didn't come out until 82. But. I thought Sears did away with the Atomic logo after 1980. I mean, on the fans, it was about maybe 78, but on everything else, I think it was 1980. I could be wrong. And 9 times 9 times 10, I usually am. And by the way, it's an EF-12 SP2, that old Sanyo that I had that I got from Tori, which I still have, by the way. So yeah, the design's the same. Push-button controllers. Side. back 
and the other side. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna oh good, that's handle, cool. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna plug it up and we're gonna give it a go. So I guess we're ready. Here's high. I honestly don't feel much air because it feels like it's constricting, but that's just me. I guess it's Canadian safety feature, eh? But watch out for hockey pucks. Medium. Of course, also it's cold, so I mean it's been sitting in the it's been sitting in the box, in the car for a few weeks because once again, no blanking ambition. Which I'm still gonna have to explain that one day. Nope. And how low can you go? Oscillation. Yeah, that clip you saw, I'm going to have to try and bend it back into shape because... I mean, yeah, even though the other two are holding, I don't trust this bitch! Medium. Spin down time now. <laughs> Since I got the kilowatt meter up, I mean, even though it is for 120 volts and everything, we have to tighten that thing down. Okay, can I ask, okay, let me ask a stupid question. <clears throat> Why is that oscillating desk fans are a bit more efficient or lower wattage than box fans? Answer below. Oh, wait, that's volt amps. Wait, that was watts. Oh, huh, three-tenths of an amp. Hmm. Well, you get the idea. Medium. Almost a quarter of an amp and 30 watts. So, and no, I'm not going to do the oscillation with the amp and everything because the differences are so minute. 0.5 watts and two tenths of an amp. How nice. That's going to do it for this video of this unique Canadian Sears Nyan model 564-4228002. One long ass model number. Unfortunately made in Mexico, but hey, still better than today's Walmart grade crap, am I right? <laughs> but no, I only bought this because, I mean, it's Canadian Sears. I don't have a Canadian Sears. And the Atomic logo, which they kept longer than... Here in the states which i don't know how or i don't know why or why should i even care but it's unique in a way and plus i have the other one i can't remember off the top of my head and i mentioned it i mean all i know is an ef12 sp2 that's Samuel one that i got from tori some years back but i may actually compare that one with this one who knows but for now it's just another one 
I think it's pretty cool, by the way. But like I said, that's my opinion. I'm entitled to it. Whatever. So till next time, wherever it is, I'm going to say thanks for watching. Comment box is open. Yeah.